Damian Adams here with Burn City Sports. Yesterday, the Houston Texans defeated the Arizona Cardinals 21-16. The Houston Texans are now 6-4, while the Arizona Cardinals fell to 2-9. Let's talk about how Kyler Murray played in this game. In this game, Kyler Murray went 20-30, 214 yards, one touchdown, and one interception. Now, his stats aren't bad at all, but he didn't come through in the big moments when it really mattered for this team. For example, in that interception, Hollywood Brown was wide open. He had him. All he had to do was get out there sooner or throw it farther, and that's a touchdown. But he underthrew it, and Derek Stingley Jr. was able to catch up to it and intercept the pass. On one of those incompletions, it was on a big fourth down. Trey McBride is wide open going across the middle, and he throws a wobbly duck that goes into the ground. The rust really showed for him in his big moments. There was another big moment in the game where the Texans blitzed and he didn't do the hot read on the right side. He went to the wrong side, got sacked. And that's going to be expected for a guy who's coming back for his second game in damn near a year. So you can't really expect too much from him, but I did expect him to play better against his Texans defense, which their passing defense wasn't highly ranked coming in. I even started Kyler Murray over Trevor Lawrence in one of my fantasy leagues, and Trevor Lawrence had his best game of the year. Now, I'm not upset about that or anything. I'm not salty at all. Uh, let's just move on. Texans wide receiver Tank Dell was huge in this one. He had eight receptions for 149 yards and a touchdown. I love his route running, the speed, which he can cut in and out of his breaks, his ability to adjust when plays don't go to plan. You saw that on the touchdown catch where CJ Stroud went out the pocket, pointed to him, he knew where to go and how to get there. Tank Dell is going to be a really good receiver for the Texans. Texans rookie quarterback C.J. Stroud had a very interesting game as he went 27 for 37 for 336 yards, two touchdowns, and three interceptions in this one. Now, he had special moments that showed you why he's been playing so well this season. The touchdown pass to Tank Dell was definitely one of those. Just perfection on improvising and showing your receiver where to go and also making the pass after making that decision. Just chef's kiss on that one. But he also had three interceptions in this one. And this was not only his first three interception game of his pro career. This was the first time he threw three interceptions in a game in his life. He didn't do it in college at Ohio State, didn't do it in high school. Unless there's some middle school footage that I'm unaware of, this was the first time he did this in his life. That's unbelievable when you talk about the consistency of taking care of the ball. Uh, C.J. Stroud's potential is unlimited. Like This guy is going to be special as long as the Texans continue to take care of him with protection and good coaching. But he definitely can't make the mistakes he made in this game next week as they take on the Jacksonville Jaguars in a huge AFC South matchup. And the Arizona Cardinals take on the LA Rams, who are also struggling this year. So it's kind of a struggle bowl.